Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. This is Beauty with Cat, and today I am here with another wig review. This time from Julia's Hair. As you can see on the back of the box is how you can take care of the hair, which is so dope. This is the hair outside of the packaging. The texture of this hair is Brazilian hair. So the specs of this hair, it is 20 inches. It has a 180 density. She is a 13 by four lace frontal unit. And she has a transparent lace, which you can see in the video. She has three combs. And then of course she has adjustable straps as well. Sorry y'all, this was a YouTube channel that I was listening to. They had these songs, um, I believe the YouTube channel is called Chill Hop. Y'all, a vibe, okay? So I be writing down the song titles and everything so I can look it up on my free time and stuff because they have some bops on there, okay? So I want to jump straight into actually just straightening the unit because like I said, I have OCD. I don't care how straight a unit is sent to me. I need it straight, 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 okay? Also, also make sure you guys wash these units before you put them on top of your head. I am only doing this for entertainment purposes, for tutorial purposes. So yes, make sure when you are receiving these units from these companies, you wash the unit and i believe you should be washing them with a uh, sulfate free shampoo and conditioner so yeah So to tame some of these flyaways, I did use some of my foamy mousse. I know a lot of people use uh, wax sticks. Um, I don't know. I feel like I am a person that hates to put too much product because I know how heavy handed I am. So yes, if you want to use foamy mousse, if you want to use uh, the wax stick, you can do whatever you want to do as long as you know, you're not weighing the hair down too much. Oh, y'all, did y'all peep my nappity nap naps in the back? Giddy bag bag. Oh, my God. Y'all, please don't be talking about me too much. Look, y'all probably didn't even notice it, and I'm sitting up here highlighting it. Anyways, so at this point, <laughs> I am cutting the lace. Um, I usually see people applying the wig on and everything, um, but I love to just take the lace off and everything before I... Uh, melted down on my head I don't know it's, it's, it's a habit y'all so right now I will be adding my Juvia's Place foundation in the color Burkina I believe that's the name of it it's in 310 and I'm just coloring the lace and I am wiping off the excess makeup that is on my forehead so the glue and the lace don't have to be too messy on top of my head because of the makeup um, of course I use my got to be gel and I use my got to be spray for just extra security for me I need to actually invest in like actual um, lace glue if y'all could y'all can recommend them down in the comments below because that would be extremely helpful for me y'all what was actually so dope about this is that usually when I get units and I put them on my head, I have to cut off like extra air flaps on the side. What, when I tell you this wig fit 
perfectly on my 21 inch head yes my head is small but y'all it fit beautifully so that was definitely a plus After blow drying, I did want to um, lay everything down and just let it dry. So I put my scarf on for a good like 10, 15 minutes. I don't know what I was talking about. I was probably talking to my mama. She probably was, I don't know, saying anything, girl. Probably was gossiping. Girl, don't know. But um, yeah, as you can see, this hair. <laughs> y'all see how straight that is? Do y'all see how straight this hair is? Fire, okay? I wish that the makeup and the lace blended way more better with my face because the makeup that I have on my face is the same as the coloring of the lace but because um, I really feel like if you apply wigs bare face and then you know do your makeup the lace is going to be very undetectable but because I already had makeup on my face and I'm reapplying foundation on top of set foundation of course it's going to kind of have that discoloration a little bit so yeah next time i'm gonna just you know be bare faced and then apply my makeup So as you can see, I am about to start adding makeup to my pardon space and this is going to make so much of a difference on how realistic this unit looks on top of my head. Y'all, y'all. Like I told y'all, I am very heavy handed. So you see, I kind of sloppily applied that makeup on top of my head. So I am wiping that off with a cotton swab that has a little bit of alcohol on it, just to remove some of that excess makeup off. today's video i truly don't have nothing negative to say about this unit this unit's texture the length the lace and how it laid down all were tens tens i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you want to know anything about this unit everything will be in the description box below um, if you like this video give it a thumbs up if you would like to subscribe to my channel please hit that subscribe button and like always i appreciate y'all so much for coming back to my channel and i will talk to y'all later peace